In 2006, there were 28,291 organ transplants in the United States. The pie chart, which we'll look at on the next page in a minute, shows the percentages for six main transplants. How many kidney transplants were there in 2006? And how many liver transplants? And how many heart transplants? Let's take a look at the pie chart. This shows us the um, organ transplants in the United States in 2006. We're interested in kidney transplants. We see that 59% of transplants were kidney transplants. We're also interested in liver transplants. We see that they accounted for 22% of transplants. And finally, we're asked about heart transplants, and we see that they accounted for 8% of organs transplanted in the United States in 2006. So we'll use the five-step problem solving process to do this, and we'll begin by familiarizing ourselves with the problem. And to do that, we will make sure that we understand what the problem is asking, and then we'll assign a variable to each of the three things that we're trying to find. So let's let K equal the number of kidney transplants, L equal the number of liver transplants, and H equal the number of heart transplants in the United States in 2006. So we have a variable for each of the three numbers that we're trying to find. Now we'll go to the second step, which is to translate the problem into some kind of mathematical language. And we'll translate to three equations. The first question that we are asked is, what number is 59% of 28,291? And this refers to the kidney transplants. We let K represent the kidney transplants, the number of kidney transplants. Is translates to equals. For now, we'll just write 59% as 59% of translates to multiplication. And then we have 28,291. So we have an equation that will help us find the number of kidney transplants. Now we'll look at the equation that deals with liver transplants. In this case, we're asked what number is 22% of 28,291. What number is the number of liver transplants? And remember, we let L represent that number. Again, is translates to equals. Then we have 22%. We'll translate of to multiplication. And we have the number 28,291. And finally, we need to find the number of heart transplants. Remember that we let H represent that. We're, what we're asking is, what number is 8% of 28,291? We let H represent the number of heart transplants. Is is equals. We have 8% of translates to multiplication. And again, we have 28,291. So we have three equations. And we can solve each of them by uh, converting percent notation to decimal notation and then carrying out the multiplication. So let's go to that step, the third step of our process. This is our first equation, k equals 59% times 28,291. 59% written in decimal notation is 0 0.59, and we're multiplying this times 28,291. And when we carry out this multiplication and round to the nearest one, we get that it's approximately equal to 16,692. Now let's solve this equation. Again, we'll convert to decimal notation. 22% can be written 0 0.22. And we have times 28,291. And again, multiplying and rounding to the nearest one, we find that this is approximately equal to 6,224. And the third equation, again, we're going to convert the percent to decimal notation. 8% is 0 0.08. And then we have times 28,291. And multiplying and rounding to the nearest one, we get, 22, we get 2,263. Now, the fourth step in the process is to check the answers. One way to do this would just be to repeat the multiplications to be sure we hadn't made a mistake in multiplying. Another thing that we could do would be to work backwards. Um, we could start with this number, say 16,692, and we could ask um, this question, 16,692 is 59% of what number? And if we 
solved this equation, the number that we should get is this number, 28,291. We could also do that with the other two uh, results that we got. And when we do either of these processes, we do find that the answer checks. So we can go to the fifth step in the equation solving process, which is to state the answer. We would say there were 16,692 kidney transplants, 6,224 liver transplants, and 2,263 heart transplants in the United States in 2006.